going guys it's Greg Campbell angry tones riff clips coming at you with another brand new video this thing right here kicks major ass you guys I am loving this thing you guys this is a brand new pedal from Am Amplified, A-M-M -M Amplified. Uh, Anthony over there in Chicago has built a version two series of the Venom Inc. Tony Dolan Signature Boost. Now this thing is absolutely amazing. The original had a really nice snarl to it, nice growl, nice overdriven boost kind of a sound to add to any amplifier. However, this one's got this switch right here. You can get the original style that's been modified a little bit with a little bit more bite little bit more angry sounding and you've got the mod section for modern gives it a little bit more modern edge a lot more mid-range snarl even a more tighter focused low end even though they're both pretty tight but it's just got a little bit more fangs to it so if you're playing some more extreme metal you're gonna be able to get there with no problem at all the pedal itself is very simple you got two knobs volume and gain that is it Use your volume to increase the output. Use your gain to increase the saturation and overall tone as far as how much gain you're adding to the signal to your amplifier to give it an overdriven or a boosted tone. You've got your input and your output. You've got your DC and you've got your red metal stomp. Just gives it a really cool look as well in my opinion. So let's check it out. I'm going to be using my Gibson Explorer Melody Maker series. This is a beautiful guitar from 2011. It's got a maple body, mahogany neck, maple fretboard that's been roasted, and it's also got a Gibson 491T humbucker that just sounds fantastic with this guitar. I'm not going to change it. So let's go ahead and hear what we got. This guitar, this amp, we are running my Randall 412 cabinet with four PV Triple X speakers. I love the way they sound. Let's see how it responds all together with the Venom Inc. boost. Let's go ahead and see what it sounds like with the amplifier without the boost. Then we're going to go ahead and hit it in the LTD mode, which is the original with a little bit more bite going on. Actually, a lot more bite. <laughs> and let's go ahead and try the mod, the modern voicing, and see how this responds to the amplifier. It's making it more of a tighter focus to find, you know, kind of a heavier pick attack kind of thing going on obviously a tighter low end so let's hear the original signal let's toy around with a switch and uh, you guys tell me which one you like better <laughs> the gain on the amplifier at just barely about one o'clock in channel three the red setting let's go ahead and hit the boost everything's at noon we're in LTD mode Instantly, I am loving the chug. It's very aggressive. It's got a really nice punch to it. Um, considering you only got two knobs, it's sounding fantastic. Let's try. Modern setting. Everything's at noon. <laughs> setting. Let's play around with that for a second. Thank you. 
switch into the modern mode you're right off to the races with uh, ultra high gain territory for like extreme metal whatever let's go ahead and a b m ltd <laughs> Thanks, Anthony, for sending this thing out. It really sounds fantastic. I gotta admit, I like both sides equally. The LTD, original mode with more bite, really seems to emphasize and focus on a little bit more of a mid-range growl, in my opinion, but still keeping a tight, focused, um, really defined low end. But when I do hit it to the modern section, it kind of gives you those warm and fuzzies, you know, with the music that's going on nowadays, a little bit more extreme metal. Even going back to earlier thrash, it's giving you that more of a boosted tone where you still have that nice mid-range snarl in there on your upstrokes and your chugs. However, it's got a lot more clarity and it seems to have a lot more brilliance to your tone where it's just a little bit more of what you might be wanting as far as a even tighter low end. I mean, really precision, really precise, as well as a lot more top end that's emphasizing and giving you a perfect balance of the lows, mids, and highs. Um, one thing we haven't done is let's crank up the gain. I like to put it a little bit over noon. Let's try it in LTD mode. Let's crank up that gain.
you guys, but I absolutely love this thing and think everyone should go out and get one. I believe, I believe, according to Anthony, there's only 50 of these things being made as of now. It's a limited run. It's absolutely crushing. Killer high gain tones. Can't say enough good things about it. There's a lot of great pedals on the market, but this is a very simple, very effective, very efficient boost for any amplifier. I mean, this amp sounds great on its own, but everybody knows Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifiers have a little bit of a warmer vibe, even though the newer ones are a lot more aggressive, and they do have a little bit more brilliant sides to them, depending on how you EQ it. They fix some of that flubbiness. However, this right here is pure magic. I mean, if you could put hell in a box, this is what it would sound like. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go ahead and play a few riffs before we close out, but thanks again. Anthony at Amp Amplified for sending out this pedal and for the killer shirt. Love it. It's hot as hell in Nashville, but it's cool in the house. But I mean, playing riffs like this, it's getting hot as hell in here too. So I'm going to go ahead and continue to jam out and increase the gain just a little bit on the uh, modern mode that we're still in, the mod mode, just because I love it. Right now, I'm going to have to say I like them both equally, but the modern mode definitely got my attention. <laughs> sounded killer with this new guitar I'm actually really liking it and it sounded great with this amp so thanks for checking it out definitely like and subscribe below if you haven't already go ahead and follow AMM Amplified follow Anthony and all of his endeavors and brand new things he's been building I'll leave a link in the description below definitely subscribe so you guys can be informed on any new things coming out in the future keep it metal keep it angry and We'll see you guys next time.